The annual Irving ISD exhibition of student art continues with the Middle School's Art Show. Peter Arnell was there and he brings us the story. There are a number of ways that children can express themselves, writing, singing, throwing tantrums, but there are a select number of middle school students who have found another way of expressing themselves through art. Some of their works are here on display at the Irving Art Center. We've got eight middle schools in Irving ISD, uh, so each one probably brought around 100 or so pieces, so we're looking at about 800 to 1,000 works of art. With quite a few pieces of art to judge, how were those selected to make it to the show? Generally by the teachers, teachers and other staff members at the school. Uh, I, I know myself, I sorted through all the projects that my kids had done all year, so I think I dug through about 2,000 works of art to uh, to kind of whittle it down, kind of show the breadth of work that we do. Uh, you know, I think each teacher kind of tried to bring uh, a mixture of mediums and just kind of the strongest work from their students. I like how we can, I can express myself through art and we have, I can, I just be so creative with it. I like how you can like um, put all these colors, inspirations and everything, what you like in it. Well, I like expressing my feelings with the art because I, um, because it actually is the only way I can write and, and draw everything and all my feelings that I want to do. Uh, I love art. Art is amazing. It's, you can express yourself in so many different ways, it's not even funny. You can see you know, a drive and a little extra kind of spark in them when they're, when they're working on their projects, and, and especially tonight, them seeing their works hanging on the wall in the gallery. I think, it, I think this will inspire them to go a little bit further, too. Since kindergarten, my artwork has been displayed in, in the art exhibit, and I, I feel like proud, and I feel like I'm doing good, and it makes me feel good. Most of the time when I have spare time, I do draw stuff like that because it's fun. I get to draw whatever I want. I can make it look like myself. I usually do it when um, I'm, I'm supposed, uh, like, when I don't have anything else to do, when I'm bored, I usually draw or paint. I like to draw a lot of how my feelings are each day. Like if I'm mad, I'll draw something mad, just putting whatever color in it. If I'm happy, I'll just draw something. I'll maybe try and recreate something that I did in art class or you know, maybe try to see how I can make it better, make it my own. And then there are some who don't even know their talent. They need a push, they need a push. They're still pretty young and so they need a push and they, they come around and kind of their own time and, uh, and it's, it's fun to see them kind of finally get it every now and then and, and start to really enjoy it. It's inspiring and it can like really help you have like creative ideas and inspire people to do what they want to draw that comes up in their imagination. It's always good to see how our children express themselves and some of these children express themselves very well in art. At the Irving Art Center, I'm Peter Arnell. Up next, the High School's Art Exhibit running March 27th through 31st in the Irving Arts Center Main Gallery. Visit irvingisd.net and click the Fine Arts link for more information.